Hi, in this episode, I'll show you how to change your color on your design. Uh, first of all, um, you got to pick whichever color you want. You have to decide before you start making the changes what color you want and what color is going to replace what. Okay. In this case, I decided that the brown right here, the light brown is going to be replaced by um, a light blue and the red is going to be replaced by a gold and the black is going to be replaced by a navy. Okay. All right. Let's get started. Now, uh, the main piece is a clip art. Let's start with the clip art first. Okay. Here we have uh, three pieces of clip art. Clip art one. Clip art two, which is the people, and clip art three, which is the tree. Okay, let's start with the main piece of clip art. All right, so let's click here to activate it. Okay, there it is. Now, don't mind these colors down here. Okay, just just click on the color wheel. Here, you're gonna see the colors that are active. Okay, uh, right now the black, which is active right now. It has the circle around it, and there's the black right there. So the first thing we're going to change is the black. Okay, since it's already active, let's just go ahead and pick the king blue, which is the navy blue. Okay, the red, if I click it, you will see now this red is active. So that's the red that's representing it. Okay, so we want this red to change. So we're going to go ahead and pick uh, the gold to change it with. Okay, now you see the gold is active and the red is active. So that means these two are coordinating with each other. Okay, click the... the um, the sand color or the light brown, which is here, is active. I want to change that to the light blue. Go ahead and click it. And then I hit apply. Okay, so that's my first piece of clip art. Now I want to go ahead and change the other pieces of clip art. Okay. All right. So let's click on the people right here. I want to make them navy. All right. You want to keep a dark color. Okay. Navy hit apply okay uh, let's do the tree click on it um, right now you see the blue the, the black is kind of active let's go pick the, the king blue right here there it is hit apply okay all right so let's change the text uh, let's start with a 2009 you can go ahead and change that if you need to let's put 2010 um, click on the color wheel king blue okay you see it change all right uh, many branches one tree you can click on it here or come over here and find it click on the color wheel king blue changed Charlotte North Carolina you can either come over here and find it here which is right here you can click on the box and it'll active or you can click over here okay see now this blue box around it makes it says that it's active and the um, the bounding box lets you know that it's active okay change the color king blue all right so I have this change now the uh, main text up here at the top I want to change that too okay so let me click on that all right uh, the main text right now is brown or sand color light brown I want to change that to gold Okay, now I want to change the um, the stroke around the text. It's two different strokes. It's the black and the red. I want to change both of those. Okay, so I'm going to click on the stroke option right here. Okay, the black, I want to go ahead and change that to navy. Okay, it's going to go ahead and make the change. And after it makes the change, you come back and click on it again. Some browsers allow you to do it. Um, at the same time this one that I'm using right now that I'm recording from doesn't allow you to do that okay so I'll click on there and uh, here's the red I'm going to change the red to the light blue okay and there you go that's how you change your text all right thanks for watching